So, who likes treasure? Me. You like treasure? You actually put it in your hand though, like you're in school. Kid, you ain't in school, you're at home, boy. So, being since you like treasure, yeah, we're gonna start off this video with a little treasure hunt. Okay, Ma, you look very, very excited. I wanna find some treasure, I wanna go on a treasure hunt. If you could find any treasure in the world, yeah. what would it be? Treasure, innit? Money, innit? Money? Yeah. No gold or anything like yeah, that? Gold. Okay, yeah, gold. Okay, you wanna find gold? Yeah. Today yeah. might be your lucky day, kid. It might be your lucky day. Okay, so I've got a wicked idea using the HP MV. In a minute, some clues to the treasure hunt are gonna pop out of this printer. Then it's up to you two to find the treasure. Alright, do you know what? Do you know what? These are absolutely hopeless, yeah, of finding treasure. I've done this before on the channel. We did a treasure hunt and it literally lasted hours. So I'm gonna make this easy, but not too easy, if you go on trying to say. So I'm thinking something like maybe it's a triangle, we hide something in the pool table. Yeah, for this. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, triangle, and we're gonna hide something in the pool table. So I'm gonna be honest, usually I'll be worried about running out of ink. And there's nothing worse than needing to use your printer. You go to print it on out and it all comes out like grey or black or do you know what I mean? And you want it in colour and it comes out totally wrong. But look Luckily, I don't have that problem because we have signed up to HP Instant Ink. Now, what is HP Instant Ink, you might ask? So basically, there's different plans and you choose your plan depending on how much paper you actually use. And then your printer automatically detects how much paper it's used and then it sends out brand new ink cartridge before you run out of ink. So basically, it's all about sustainability, guys. The less waste, the better. So how many times have you had something on subscription and it keeps turning up every single month and you don't actually need it and you've just got loads just building up in your house? Now, this limits that. So you only actually use what you actually need and that's good for the environment. Wait, I swear this is a pool triangle, so you put the pool ball in it. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I don't know. Maya, what is it? I don't know. It is. It is. Yeah. Alright, go, go and do what you gotta do. Okay, where would it be? Where would it be? Alright. Yeah. Yeah. No. Oh. You're finding some treasure. Treasure? Yes. You're finding some treasure. That's not the Use treasure. No. Use your clue. Use your clue. And where could it be? Where could it be? Oh, I don't know. I don't want to give anything away. It could be in the pool table. I don't know. Come on, Lorenzo. Come on. Come on. It's got to be in there somewhere. Where is the treasure? Come on. We're going to find the gold. Where's the gold, Maya? Where's the gold? Where's the gold? We're going to find it. Oh, where could it actually be? It's actually See, this is what I mean. This is why we kept it nice and simple. We kept it nice and simple because if not, we will be here all day. <laughs> this is easy. Come on, find the treasure. Sarai found it. Hey. Okay, Sarai. Okay, so Sarai so, so right found the chocolate coin, which is our gold. Obviously, we couldn't afford no real gold. So this is what I have to do, man. Well done. Wait, how Lorenzo. did that live with a triangle? What do you mean? Huh? Pool room? Was that a pool clip? I don't know. That's was it a pool clip? I actually thought you put it in the pool table. I was gonna, but I thought that was too, too, too easy. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> straight away, like, pool. I just thought you'd come to the right location. You did come to the right location. You just looked in the wrong place. Unlucky. On to the next treasure. Alright. Meanwhile, Romelo's out here trying to get the VR to work on the telly. Yeah. He's struggling. Yeah. You're supposed to be the computer guy, man. Yeah, Jeez, I left you look. with a simple job. I left you with a simple job, but you can't do it. Nah. Come on, man. Okay, second coin, dishwasher. All right. You said it'd be too loud, didn't you? Yeah, look up here. Where should I put it? Put it anywhere. Oh, should I put it? Okay. You think they're gonna be able to see that though? Or you think that's a bit too hard? We gotta make some of it hard. Can't be too easy. I think that one was kind of easy. I thought he was gonna put it at the pool table though. Okay, all right. This is a challenge and then we'll see how they get on. We'll all see. Right. Let's go. Very be good this time. So there's loads of dirty dishes. It has to be in the sink or the dishwasher. It has to be in the kitchen. It must be the sink or the dishwasher. Okay, this is the last of the treasure hunt. Okay, there's yeah. no more after this one. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Go. Where's the Renzo going? He's looking in the dishwasher. Yeah. She's looking. Yeah. Who's got it? Who's got it? Who's got it? Oh, has got it. Oh my gosh. Come on, that was easy as well. Yeah. That was easy. I literally grabbed it before her. She snatched out my hand. Oh, she did. She, she opened it. She opened it. Yeah. I touched that. She literally just grabbed it like so that. You got it. She had it in her hand. Because she snatched it out of my hand. Oh, you let her snatch it, really? Dad, come on, man. She snatched it out of my hand. So you say you deserve to win? Yes, yeah, she snatched it out of my hand. I don't know. I don't know. Guys, leave in the comment section below. Does Lorenzo deserve to win it? Or yeah. does it deserve to be a draw? Let me know. Time to wake everybody up. Bug, Tiago, Bug, Tiago, time to wake up, mate. It's morning. I'll be downstairs with your clothes and breakfast. Soraya, good morning. Time to wake up. And you, Snug. And by the looks of it, Mello's already out of bed. So that saved me a job. Let's go downstairs and let out the pets. Good morning, Nana. Ouch. <laughs> 
Good morning, Nana. You ready? Are you steady? Go. She'll come running back in any second. There you go. Told you. <laughs> Where you go? That's there. Out. Come on. Do we we? Go go. Good morning, baby man. Hi, Beans. You want to go out for a wee? Let Carla do her business first because you know how she is in the morning. Morning, kitties. <laughs> Hello, baby wavy. Say hi, everybody. Good morning. Morning, Raven. So, that was quick. Diago, you look hella stressed. Every morning you look stressed. What do you want for breakfast? Hot chocolate and egg. Okay. Lorenzo, morning. You okay? Tired? Okay. <laughs> yeah, training last night, got back in late. He had a late session last night, so he didn't get back until just got nine o'clock. Oh, then he had homework to do. Night. Pardon? Oh, what's you went to sleep? Good boy, good boy. Right, I'll start your breakfast. Lorenzo, you, obviously you can sort yourself out. Mm -hmm. I'll get your clothes, Tiago. And then we gotta do your fruit and get ready to go to school. Good morning, guys. So, in the morning, I typically get up first, um, sort myself out, come downstairs, have a coffee, kind of wake myself up, do my skincare routine, and then I kind of see what needs to be done before I get the kids up, is there anything I need to tidy off? Sometimes I give over the like, living room with Hoover and stuff. And and then I wake them up. Tiago usually comes down pretty quickly because when he's woken up, he's awake and he starts not panic, but he starts to be like, oh, I've got school kind of thing. So he comes running downstairs, so I have to make sure I've got his hot chocolate ready. And then he tells me what he wants for breakfast. Sometimes it's cereal. Most of the time it's egg, like fried egg or scrambled egg in the morning. That boy has an appetite. Twins usually come down the their last. They just slowly get up, get dressed, come downstairs, and now they are, well, they're 10, so I make them make their pack lunches. I think it's just something that I feel like it just encourages them to be more, a little bit more independent. I could make it happen any time to do it but I feel like it's more of like a job that I can do themselves. All I have to do is make a sandwich and there's loads of other things already prepared and to put into their lunchbox and off they go. Lorenzo comes down, he'll slowly come down, get his clothes on, have some cereal, probably sit there on his phone even though it's not allowed um, and then they'll all head out the door to go to school. But in the morning it's kind of busy because we always have something going on and today Marcelo's going to my mum's so I have to sort out his stuff as well. It's meant to be a good day today with the sunshine so I've got to pack him some toys from the garden. So yeah, it's all go, go, go. Here you go, one hot chocolate. Right, let me start your egg. How do you want it today? Normal egg or scrambled egg? Normal egg. So my dad usually arrives around quarter to eight. He comes and plays and deals with Sakana. I could go in the garden, he'll tidy up all her mess, wash it down, play with her a little bit. Then he takes the twins to school in the morning because he loves doing his granddad duties. Comes back, takes Sakana for a walk, tidies the garden up a little bit, see if we need anything done around the house, lights changing, anything like that. And then yeah, off he goes during the afternoon back home. Did you do it inside? Yeah. You did it inside? They've gone. Um, they've gone, yeah, but um, Granda says you put the ones in the red bed when I take them real go. Oh my god. The, the, one of them uh, is like, yeah. Can you say that again in English? One of them. Yes. Is like board, so it's fine. My god. That mellow, I swear down. Oh god, another early morning. Can't wait till these kids break up from school, man. I'm knackered. Morning, Maya. Morning. What's going on? I know you say you didn't come in and say good morning to me. Again. No, you don't. Listen, I can meet you on the top of the stairs and you will walk straight past me and not even say good morning. What is up with that? You, before, back in the day, you used to be the first person to walk in the bedroom, do you know what I mean? Say good morning and everything. Now, you don't say anything at all. You changing, you know? I swear down, you're changing. You think you're too nice for me now. That's what it is, isn't it? You think you're too nice, be honest. Is that what it is? Think you're sassy? I got a news flash for you, little girl. You ain't sassy. You got that? <laughs> Need you to do me a big favor. What? Fat man's going to my mum's. Yes. I'm going to take some garden stuff in the B class. Oh my God, first thing in the morning. Do you know what time it is? I do know what time it is. I've been oh up like, uh, uh, like long Ten time past ago. eight. So if we don't leave in the next five, we're going to be late for everything. You know that, innit? Yeah, that five minutes over there is fine. I don't know whether to come on a school run today. I don't know whether to come. Do you know what, I might as well. I'm gonna come on the trip. Okay. Right, what am I having for breakfast? Don't eat frosties anymore because they're full of sugar. Don't eat wheat toast anymore because they're full of sugar. Don't eat Cheerios, which are the honey ones, because they're full of sugar. Rice Krispies, believe it or not, are even full of sugar. These are nice, but I think they've got too much sugar in it as well. Oh my so, God. <laughs> the only thing I can sugar. eat, I know, is wheat and bix And you know what? That's I've been eating it non stuff yet yeah, for the last, what, two, three months, and I'm getting bored of eating wheat and bix So I have wheat or boiled eggs, but today I'm gonna have wheat and bix 
Do I? <laughs> you need to what? You need toilet roll. No, no, you need toilet. There is no Oi, you didn't put the bins out last night. You got Sienna getting up all early in the morning, put no, the bins out and stuff. Melo, your day know, know, is Monday night and you know that. Don't even try it. You're slacking, boy. I swear down. You're slacking. Not putting the bins out. Well, I was thinking the hair up properly the other day when I tried to clean the hair out of the games room. What? 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 Come with me then, come with me then. All right, so over here is clean, but if I walk around, look, there you are, there's hair. So you couldn't even do it properly because you're in a mad rush. Wait, hold on, if you saw it. Yeah. Why did you clean it up? Because every time we get our hair cut, yeah. yeah, who cleans it up? Who cleans it up? I am me or you? No, no, it's me. Unless I ask you to do it, yeah. it's me that cleans it up. Yeah. Who pays for the haircut? <laughs> exactly. How old are you? Almost. Hey, news flash. You know what's coming in it. What yeah. am I going to say right now? Please tell me what I'm going to say right now. Go on, tell me what am I going to say? I was the haircut. No. Yeah. Not only that, I'm going to say something else as well. 18, boy. What did I say happens when you're 18? Oh. Mm -hmm. okay, exactly. I can't wait to draft up this this draft of how much rent you're going to be paying every every month or whatever week or whatever. I can't wait. I can't wait to hand some of these bills over to you, man. You're going to end up being bankrupt, you are, if you don't start putting any more work. I'm telling you, Lorenzo. You need toilet roll. You need toilet roll. Yeah. Do you know, I, did, I told people, yeah, stop going in the toilet to do doo doos or anything like that, yeah, without checking to see if there's toilet roll first. Do you know what I mean? It's not nobody else's job or responsibility to get toilet roll from downstairs while you're on the toilet doing the doo doo because you can't wipe your bottom. What's wrong with you, boy? Oh, so I'm going to get it. He said he doesn't know where it is. Melo's gonna say that, isn't he? Because he can't be asked to do it. He's here, he's got the toilet roll for you. You shouldn't even bother getting it. Next time, let him do it yourself. You know what I mean? Leave a child of doo doo down the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, fat man! Look! Wow, that's a nice fresh tea. I love that car, Tiago. That car is wicked. You didn't build that yourself, did you? Who helped you? Mello. Mello helped you. I love it, it's nice. Wow. Yes, Boogie? Yes, sir. Oh, you got training today again, innit? Yeah. This is crazy. You going on a uh, transport? You come back on first. Let's see if he can fit through the door first, let alone in the what? car. Not in the car anyway. Because my, he, we don't need it at the house, we've got loads, and he's going to my mum, it's going to be nice today. Just go, just take it out into the car. You questioned him before. Oh, it don't fit. Don't it fit through the door. It yeah, fit. But that door's bigger. Angle it. Just angle it. Angle it no, like go that half of it in first. Oh See, you're mashing down the plate. Don't beat. Angle it, knife. Turn one side. So. Don't beat. Okay. All right. Second option. What? Front side okay, of the house. Got to do side of the house. Try and get it to the front of the house, please. <laughs> in less than it's two gonna minutes. It's gonna be late for college. Oh wow. Well. <laughs> We gotta leave now, man. If we don't leave now, we're gonna be late. Or we're probably already here. Oh, late, innit? Yeah, to be honest. Once, it's just like, no. Yeah, I know. Every day, though, man. Hi. Jesus. Hi. Straight on the phone, kid. Hi. Jesus, straight on the phone. Hi. How do you do it? Hold my phone. Just tell me, how do you do it in the morning? Watching sidemen laughing yeah. in the middle. I'm not allowed to hold my phone. You are allowed to hold it. But yeah, that's what Is that all you're doing? Is holding it? Yeah. You're lying. You, you got no screen case on your phone? No. Yeah, you're the most yeah. clumsiest person with the phone as well. Guaranteed you're going to drop that and crack it. Right, come, let's let's get moving, man. See you later, twins. Bye. Have a good day. Now it's time to get this into the back of the V class. I know it can fit because it isn't that big, but everyone's trying to make out like it's awkward and that simple. I'm guaranteed Nathan cannot find the car keys. He always loses the keys. We have a spot for the keys right in here. See, that's what I said. He always loses the keys. Mr. Nathan Greer, come on, man. Found him. Do you not, listen, do you know how many millions of things I got to think about? Same here. Yesterday, yeah, no, honestly, these keys are put by the laptop. Yeah. Yesterday I went to training. Yes. Obviously, books training. Yes. I made two videos yes. before books training. Yes. And took the laptop with me to training. Yes. yes. Edited, yes. battery run out. Don't just say, yes. come back, edit again. Yes. I've had the keys in it. Here's what it is. Yeah. Not me. God, this is the longest morning ever. Just about squeezed in there as well, man. It's a good job after Meadow struggled to bring it round. God, anyways, let's get on the score run. It's so late. What time is it now? 33 minutes past, but in all fairness, yeah. yeah. We've never later than this before. Yeah, we have. We, we can are. still get around time if we leave now. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? We are. Come, just go in. I'm going in. This is what we've got to deal with every single morning on the score run traffic on the motorway it's an absolute nightmare and the dumb thing about it is there's not other way to go but there is there's roadways to go but there's traffic everywhere anyway but feel, makes no difference i feel like it's so hit and miss because sometimes you can go on the motorway and it's not this busy and you, you can go yeah. like steadily 50 60 all the way to the junction and then sometimes you get on and you're crawling the whole way and you're literally stuck here for like 15 20 minutes sometimes longer but if you go the roadway it's very like mm, do you know Edwards, what I mean? Yeah, That's I why do that. uh, Alexander Stadium, where they're doing like the loads of road work for like Commonwealth Games. So it's very hit and miss there, but I feel like the roadway is quicker. Than this? Yeah. 
because where you come out at the roadway, you're more or less right by the Queensway. Is this you got to go on another part where there's loads of traffic? Yeah, it's true. It's like there's it's two chances long. of getting stuck in a lot of traffic. It when is you're super away. duper long, man. And look at the time as well. It's now 8.48. So everyone's late. Yeah.